good morning children i am bikesh from maulitra ji school chhasi and i am your science teacher so welcome children to the another lecture of that is chapter number 14 electric current and its effect today we are going to discuss about the magnetic effect of electric current can you recall what you studied about magnet in class 6 you know that the magnet can attract certain substances such as iron so far you have studied about electricity and magnetism separately now we are going to see how to make a electromagnet wrap a wire around a soft iron piece known as the core when an electric current is passes through the wire the iron pieces behave like a magnet a magnet made using such an arrangement is called an electro magnet as you have seen in the figure a solenoid is a device which can be used as a electromagnet it is made up of a long wire that has been bound many time usually around a hollow metallic core into a tightly packed coil and it has a shape of a long cylinder so that is how we have to make electromagnet by using wire iron nails or the iron core or for power we require a cell or a battery now if you want to increase the strength of a electromagnet so there are certain ways by which we can increase the strength of the electromagnet depending on the certain things number 1 wrapping the coil around a piece of iron such as an iron nail number 2 adding more turns to the coil and number 3 increasing the current flow through the coil so these are all the certain ways by which we can increase the strength of electromagnet let us see the places where we can use electromagnet just like motor and generator transformers pickups relay electric bells and buzzer and yes of course the light loud speaker and the headphone which you are using now a days so these all are the places where electromagnet can be used what do you do when you reach your friend's house to let him or her know that you are at the door of course you uh, you ring the doorbell do you know what makes the bell ring an electric bell has an electromagnet that pulls a strip of iron which make the hammer hit the gong to ring the bell so let us see how it is work so here is a first step when you push the switch of the electric bell an electric current flow to the electromagnet step 2 the electromagnet attract the soft iron strip the hammer attached to the strip then hits the gong making it ring if you can see the circular shape this is called gong now the step 3 when the soft iron strip get attached to the electromagnet it no longer touches the screw and hence the circuit is broken this turn off the electromagnet and it can no longer attach the soft iron strip the soft iron strip return to its initial position touching the screw that is known as interpreter this result in a circuit being completed and current flows again so step 1 2 3 repeat in quick succession as long as the switch is on and this is how we hear the continuous ring of the bell so this is how the electric bell can work in different steps so in today's video we have discussed about the magnetic effect of electric current where the magnet can be used and the working of electric well with the help of electromagnet thank